everyone and welcome to Brisa in Germany for the last two rounds of Super Enduro. Far too formal that. We've very only been here. It's very confusing this last round because it actually is the last round. It's the last it's round tomorrow. Yeah. Same Today's track. Not. Backwards. Backwards track tomorrow. Anyway, Ed's actually finally made it to a Super Enduro. He's left England. I, I'm excited. He's good. left England at long last. He's only been in the stadium 10 seconds and the camera's out. So off to a good start. I've already done a slow mo. I was shot. about to say, now Ed's here, we can do a, a professional production, so there's going to be some slow mo of the track now. Well, uh, in fact, I'm not even going to give you a brief. You can just enjoy your super enduro experience and give a third party perspective on my day. Technically, we don't have permission, but we're just going to ask for forgiveness rather than ask for permission because it's the last round, and by the time it comes out, there's going to be no more rounds, and we'll deal with that problem next year. Not weird. <laughs> So if anyone official looks like they're looking at you, hide your camera. All right, Ed. What do you reckon? Nice to see someone good on the camera this weekend. I've been complimented about my camera skills twice already. Yeah, well, I'm going to do it again. <laughs> I, can, I could actually watch this vlog. <laughs> How do you reckon Tommy would get on around this track? <laughs> I, w I personally would give him five grand if he did a lap. There's no way he's getting over no, that wall. No, that's why I say my money's safe, isn't it? <laughs> You could give him all the money in the world and he ain't getting over that. Imagine him trying to. <laughs> He'd ride round it. <laughs> Fuck that. I think for racing and stuff, this track is actually going to be really good. This this bit needs a bit of work. The inside line here is a bit shit, but... Here's Johnny now, look. You're coming to ask for some more sponsors on here. Have you got enough of Instagram? So basically, I'm uh, looking for a new sponsor. <laughs> it's got plenty. But on that subject, if anyone wants a sponsor... I'm struggling here. <laughs> I'm excited to ride. What? I can't wait for a bit of sand to go over that log and then we can start doubling the log in. Yeah. You know what I mean? A little like, bump we, coming in. We should go back. I've got something for Bill. I brought it all the way from Andorra. You got him a present? I've got him a present, mate. I don't really buy presents a lot, but this one was free to give to him. You're not set it up right? Nah, fucking. Is that the tape measure on this week as well? I've measured him and everything, but they're still Close. just not quite right. Is the grip long enough? Yeah, that'll be right, that'll be 14. He doesn't fuck that up, he knows, he knows better. <laughs> he knows he won't get fed if he fucks that up. What's been happening? Have we got much of a vlog? I feel a bit... I feel no, like I'm doing, it. Well, I feel like I'm doing a disservice, really, because I bailed on doing it in Israel. White kit today. Tighty whities. Very good. Like I, I like that. Like, big logos, but... Yeah, they like big logos. We're starting, we're going to get creative very soon. All tight. Actually, a bit erratic first few laps. My wrist was a bit sore, but then it's completely doesn't hurt at all now. That's probably due to impact. That's fixed that. <laughs> it's a hard impact off that spine. The spine is horrible. There's only one. There's only one good line eh, on that spine, like right the right in that middle right. I that started, sends you straight. I started going far left, and it was actually not too bad. Didn't go as planned earlier, so we'll have another crack at it. See if we can make it happen this time. So we're going to go autograph signing. Um, Billy should be autograph signing, and I reckon he's going to be pretty excited. Ready? 
Oh. Can you see it? It's too dark in here. Oh, oh, oh. Can you sign this, please, mate? This is, uh, this is something hey. new. Kex beanies have now been made redundant, I'm afraid. Did it go alright, do you think? Do you think he was excited? Do you think he's happy? Yeah. I remember when I got mine. And you was happy? I was absolutely <laughs> stoked. It was at Erzberg. <laughs> We're on the no Andy Noakley diet now. We're on the Rennies? On the Rennies. <laughs> I've come to get a video of you putting your helmet on for the first time. Come on, with your fucking waiter and all that. Jim at the end, don't do it, please. Dave, Dave doesn't like the jump. I like the tip, I like the sound, but I don't like the <laughs> <laughs> Why not? I don't like the landing. Are you getting banned from doing jumps by your dad? <laughs> Sounds like it's fucking like being 12 all over again. <laughs> like you show, know me too well. Helmet. That you didn't know about. Uh, I think it all worked out pretty good. We're having great debate, but we'll not lie. It wasn't completely a surprise. Should we just say that? It was a surprise two weeks ago. Yeah, I was laid on the floor outside Ed's house, crying and passed out just about. That was that was when it was a real surprise. I didn't know what the pain job was, so that was a surprise. But I think it all played out very well in the end, didn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I reckon now you'll be alright for that jump because you've got wings. Oh yeah, didn't have wings on before. <laughs> Where's Dave? <laughs> I'll be alright to do the jump now, I've got wings. <laughs> what do you mean? You you can't, can't, someone stop him doing that jump. <laughs> What? That's our kind of stuff day in the jungle. Oh, he's got wings for life now, so he's yeah. When the um... <laughs> You want us just to come and put have an ultimatum with you? <laughs> when the autograph session was on, I went round and had a look to see if they'd graded it. Nah, it's fun. Yeah. It's still jungle. It was good while it lasted. Well, if your life depended on it, you do. <laughs> and I think it does. You ready?
had quite the contrasting two motors so far, <laughs> I think you could call it Edward. I would say so. First race, bad start, got her in front by the end of the third lap, plain sailing, clicked the laps off, job was a good in. Second race, bad start, I did my usual slow off the line, so I had the full log to pick at to go over, and the one spot I went in over was straight into someone else's back wheel. So we had a little lie down first corner, got going again, knocked a good few laps off, just about caught up to Johnny, crashed it by myself in the stand, in the sand. About four laps left, still in fourth. Finger out. Managed to get in the lead, but fucking hell it was hard work. I'm absolutely bollocks now. I still can't even see straight to tell you the truth. Um we're gonna do it all again in about ten minutes time. Filter is mint to be fair. Stunty next time. <laughs> man, I don't uh, we put laid on the floor. They're indigestion in about 10 minutes. Well, anyway, while you've got the camera out, this shirt, the very shirt, is going to Disco Dave and he's taking it home. And then it's getting put up for auction to start the funds off for the Billy Bolt Foundation, which I'm. Uh, before I say something wrong, I'm not going to go into too much details about it. Just put me out back on. I've got a new app if you didn't put me new app back. No, we know, we know. <laughs> um, before I, but anyway, when once it's live, I'll obviously announce it all over socials. You'll see when it's live and you can buy the very shirt I bought tonight. It stinks of champagne. It'll probably still sink of champagne and beer. We've got a, a big a plot of land which we're trying to get council funding. We've got police support. Again, I don't really know these details. In Newcastle. It's in the northeast area. Um, big plot of land, good plot of land. But they basically want to put um, a motocross track there, some an enduro track, some trial sections, uh, like build build like a base as like workshops. So it's going to be like a, a centre where you can take the kids off the streets, troubled kids. Kids have been kicked out of school. They can go and learn. They can go and um, go and study for the day, and then go and ride bikes in the afternoon. Learn how to fix bikes, place to ride. But it's also going to be a um, a up top tier, more, well the motocross track we're planning on, a top tier motocross track, on a super enduro track. Um, so it's actually going to be a good facility as well as being a, a charity, that's the plan anyway. From Grab it down, turn notifications, go and buy merch, we've had a good day for merch haven't we Ed? Oh we've had a pinging day. Cha ching cha ching! Links in the description if you want to go and buy some, look at pink hats, fucking lovely. <laughs> Dave's got a black one, can I have a black one on? Right, can we get a sign out from Bill the Man of the People? End of vlog, start a new one tomorrow. Are we doing back to back vlogs? No, not vlog. No, I thought we could do tomorrow. Mic up and GoPro up, stun, and just have 
Stan's day at the race. Just put the GoPro on his head or on his chest or something. Get out of work. Anyway. Don't promise the people too much. Depends how much we do tonight. <laughs> yeah, right, anyway. Thanks for watching. See you in a bit.